Yes, I'm back with Apprentice. Not even doing an introduction. We're getting straight into this Apprentice. Um, yeah, um, yeah, um, yeah. The only thing I enjoyed about this week's episode is the fact that the exercises were actually quite engaging, mainly because of Simba and Megan's acting. They actually, their acting was was hilarious. I, I actually enjoyed it. I would have enjoyed something like that myself, to be fair. Um, so Abby was PM, and Mark was PM his first time. Um, Mark, shocking, poor, can't negotiate, can't sell, can't do anything. Um, Avi, he is something else. Um, he's literally a child. Like the way how he talks, he speaks like a child. He's he's just not very good as well. Um, a never poor week, a never poor episode. Both teams were rubbish. Avi's acting was poor. Um, Mark couldn't sell. Couldn't sell anything to anyone. Um, asking asking customers what they want to pay. Of course, they're gonna ask the lowest price. Poor. Um, and yeah, I've been saying this for weeks. Mark doesn't have a clue what the hell he's doing. He was he wasn't even selling the right ex the right experience at all. Like, um, especially to the older couple, he could have changed the wording. You know, he could have been like, okay, this is a historical immersive, historical immersive journey taking you back in time. Like that would have been more appealing to you know um, to the actual the customer base if you said something along those, along those lines but i'm not even getting into this i'm not getting to this um it's poor but i did enjoy simba's and megan's acting smashed it smashed it i would have definitely enjoyed doing that um even when the two ladies were complaining i'm so glad um i'm so glad they, that they stayed in character and the man said um no the lady said um oh, yo listen listen i weren't here to be shouted at i expect a magician and and a man said, I'll make you disappear. Quick thinking from somebody. I like that. I like that. Um but yeah, um the food the food situation um was a mess with the vegans and messing up the meat and the non meat and stuff. That's just terrible, terrible. Like I would actually be a, I would be appalled. Like literally I'll probably sue. I'll sue if somebody gave me something that I did not actually eat on my in my plate in my face and pay money for it. Um but yeah. Poor. Um, but in the end, in the end, um, the winning team, which was of no surprise at all, um, was Avi's team. Lucky for Avi, he had a good team around him. Um, or lucky for him that Mark was really, really poor. So in the end, Mark's team did lose. Um, and it's not surprising because he was a very poor PM from the start. Simba and Megan was good. Um, but there was there was some poor casting for the food from their side, but the sales team were awf awful, namely Mark. Um, and I genuinely think that he's to blame for this task entirely, to be fair. Poor leadership and poor planning from the start. Um, I do hate how, Vic well, I say hate, I do dislike how Victoria talks and the fact that the first class metaphor went straight over her head. Um, it just made her look, it just made her look um, as stupid as she sounds, but she does say some good things, to be fair, overall. So I let her off. And I'm so, so glad that Lord Sugar made the decision um, of who to bring back because Mark would have definitely brought back Simba and Megan and I don't think it's their fault at all. So I'm glad um, Lord Sugar was like, yeah, I'm bringing you the whole sales team back. And rightly so. But in the end, Mark went home. Mark went home and rightly so. He's been poor since day one. And he finally, finally, he finally got found out. Very, very poor. Um... But yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping there will be a better, a better episode at some point in future. But this was probably one of the best, better episodes in the last few weeks, to be fair. Mainly because, like I said, of, of the, the tasks that the teams were doing. Um, but next week, next week is men's skin care product. So let's see if it's any better in week nine. But yeah, let me know below um, your thoughts on Apprentice this week or on Apprentice in general. Um, and yeah catch me back here next week for a never breakdown and a never reaction of the apprentice peace <laughs>